the long version of how to get rolling with the level of the Kerbal Space Program using the four joystick controller. So, not good. Hmm. Little better. Okay. So first you gotta get your docking mode camera up. First you gotta set your cheats so that hat gravity is on to 0 0.01. Any more than that, and it's not gonna work. Then you gotta set your view, and now you see that my view is locked, locked, and I zoom in on the drone, I turn my fuel and electricity monitor on, I turn on RCS but not SAS, SAS is interesting, and then I go ahead and I hide this ball. So when you launch the course, you have to set the position to the correct position. And I have my position set to negative one one, and actually it's negative one zero one right now. And the longitude is what it is right there. And now that my SAS is on, Whoa, my reflection. And then once you're up off the ground, you can go ahead and fix your thing a little bit. And now you can see in the bottom left-hand corner, you can see my inputs. It's on my left, right, up and down. Here's my reverse. Here's my yaw. Here's my roll. Here's my pitch. And then here's my forward. Okay, so when flying this uh, Kerbal Space Program game, it appears to be very important that you do not hold any particular thrust going for any particular duration of time. For the most part, you want to do everything in little bursts. And it's unspectacular, to say the least, how fast you're going, but Besides the bursts appearing to be the most effective, it's really easy to get out of control, particularly when there's any rotation and you're thrusting, you get all kinds of different acceleration. As you just saw right there, any correction is a really big deal. I just want to comment that I know that my camera voice is not very good, and I apologize for the enormous number of people who probably just can't understand me very well. I should probably be talking in a stage voice where I focus a lot on voice lesson type material, speaking from certain parts of my voice rather than merely relaxing and making sound. But I never do that. Instead, I just kind of grumble. 
So you saw that long thrust didn't get me anywhere. So I want to make videos with just my computer, but when it comes to playing the game and recording the video, my computer just can't hack it. It's a fairly capable computer for its day, but it's a little bit outdated for the kind of demands that recording video gameplay and screen capture and stuff requires. This here is called a ladder in drone racing. crash so some drone racing theory here with regular quadcopter drones despite all of the fantastic discussion about how fast the drones are and how amazing their acceleration capabilities are. What's fun about drone racing and what's cool about drone racing is not how fast they go, but that you can handle them around such interesting navigational challenges. Even at humble speeds they're very fun to drive. All right, that was the end of my little track. And you see that I only have a little bit of mono propellant. But uh, you can see that if, if I rotate here, I just keep my rotation, so I have to cancel my own rotation. Or if I accelerate, and then I keep my velocity, and I have to cancel my velocity. I noticed that I have eight thrusters pointing back and I likewise have eight thrusters pointing forward but I have roughly half of that roughly one-fourth of that actually pointing at any given lateral direction so my left and right So although four thrusters are firing during that time, they're not firing in a straight line. They're kind of at an angle. Whereas if I get more direct, then I only have two thrusters. So now I'm out of fuel. 
and I'm going to see how that video worked.